Bro, don't be that person. Don't, don't be that guy. Not that guy at the gym. Look. I'm going to be honest with you. You shouldn't be judging other dudes while you're in the gym. But there's certain, like, unspoken rules that no man should do. And it's, and it's me just looking out for you. And for you to so you can be respectful to others in the gym. Today, boys, I'm going to share with you seven things that no man should do when they're in the gym. Let's hop into it. Number one. You should never shower in the gym. Okay, you can shower if you want, but I suggest you not to shower because it's just super unhygienic. It's just so easy to catch athlete's foot or any other fungus or disease in there if you're not extra careful. Plus, I used to have a buddy that worked in the gym before and I've heard the nastiest stories. Like, he's seen the, the worst of the worst, like defecation, guys urinating in, in, the, in the showers, and even a dude beating his meat. So if I were you, I would never shower in the gym. Number two, don't hit on that chick when she's into the workout. Wait at least for her cool down phase. Every girl will hit the Stairmaster at the end of her workout. I promise you that, that's when you hit on her. Just like you, she's not gonna like when you interrupt her when she's in an intense sweat and really getting her work on. So if you see her with her headphones in and she's just getting into it, just wait patiently, I promise you. It's gonna increase your chances of not getting blown off. Number three, never listen to music without headphones. This is probably the most annoying thing in, I've ever seen in the gym. Trust me, not everybody's gonna think your fire gym Spotify playlist is actually fire. On top of it being disrespectful to everybody else, it's much more effective to have that strong, loud, motivating music inside your ear because that's when you're actually gonna get motivated to get that sick pump. Bro, if you don't have quality headphones or none at all, I suggest you upgrade yourself to the quality earbuds like the Everyday E25 from our sponsor Raycon. These things sell like hotcakes. Everybody, like literally every celebrity uses this from Snoop Dogg to Ray J to Cardi B to J.R. Smith. I've seen every, almost every celebrity wear this product and it's because it sounds good. See, they, see these E25 have the premium sound, especially for gym headphones, because they're not expensive. So you don't have to be extra careful with them. They're, they're built to last, and since they're built with an in-ear design, they basically like lock into your ear canal. So it doesn't matter how much you sweat, how much you jump, or how hard you're working, those earbuds are gonna stay in your ear and produce a loud, quality sound that's actually gonna get you motivated. But the great part is you're not breaking the bank. And if you guys click the link down below, you're gonna get a special 15% off. And since they come in an array of colors, you can choose one that suits your personal style. And here's the best part. Since they have a 45 day money back guarantee, you can see if these earbuds are actually made for you. You can test them out, see how amazing they are, see what all the hype is, and if you don't like them, you can return them, no questions asked. The earbuds also come with their own little carrying case that charges the earbuds as you store them. They're super portable. They have about six hours of playtime, and they seamlessly connect to your Bluetooth almost instantly as soon as you put them into your ear. These earbuds, bro, this is what you should be using at the gym, and if you don't have quality ones, I want you you guys to click the link down below go to buyraycon.com slash tmf that way you can get your special 15 percent off and actually upgrade your gym workout experience number four just re-rack your weights bro this is not your bedroom there is nothing more annoying than me hitting the squat rack and then already having 135 on the bar and me having to clean up somebody else's slack number five wipe it down see even before lockdown this rule would still apply because especially if you sweat it like a maniac because nobody wants to lay down on your sweat you're just transferring all your bodily fluids and your bacteria to somebody else but now with covid this rule is even more crucial to always wipe down everything you touch and lay on number six never work out in your work clothes see jeans and a button down they're not going to give you the range of motion that you need on top of that sweating in that type of clothing is uncomfortable and unsanitary now while you also don't want to be this geek either, investing in quality athletic enhancing clothes will actually boost your performance in the gym, will motivate you to work harder. Number seven, texting on a machine. Especially if the gym is packed. You texting on the machine is the most disrespectful thing you could do because there's probably two, three dudes waiting on that exact machine to hit that, that body part next and now they either need to cool down to wait for you or change their entire gym routine all because you were scrolling on TikTok. And that's basically it for this week's video, guys. Those are seven gym rules that you should never break when you're in the gym. If you guys liked this video and found it informative, don't forget to drop us a like down below. Also, boys, don't forget to check out our sponsor, Raycon. They're going to be linked down below as well. That's it for me today. See you next time.